Hello and welcome. My name is Lionel Correa and this is another episode of this week's Wellness Wednesday. The standard American diet contains GMOs, trans fat, and many more unhealthy ingredients that we need to eradicate from our bodies. Our country is surrounded by fast food restaurants, bars, and grocery stores which have processed foods, food covered in pesticides, or that use GMO. Although it's virtually impossible to eat healthy all the time, and even I cheat every now and then, there are habits you can form to help keep you on track. I've been getting a lot of questions on what should I eat, how much should I eat, and when should I eat it. Although there is no one specific way to answer these questions because everyone's body type is different, there are some simple questions which can help put you on the right track. These next five questions should serve as a guideline whenever you're planning on eating a meal. If, if you answer these questions appropriately, and follow through with the correct action steps, you'll be eating healthier than many of the people in this country. Answer the following. Are you eating slowly? This is one that I struggle with personally. Anyone who knows me and, see, and seen me eat understands that I have a voracious appetite and I eat extremely fast. I am also extremely active and expend a lot of energy throughout the day, so I don't get myself in any trouble. But if you aren't as physically active, Eating slowly aids in digestion and will make you fuller faster. Aim for 15 to 20 minutes per meal and eat until 80-85% full. Where is the protein dense food? Protein is the building block of muscle. It's incredible how much protein the body needs for daily function and nutrition. Aim for 1 gram of protein consumption per body weight daily. Where are the veggies? As I mentioned before, there are no bad vegetables. It doesn't matter how you cook them. What matters is that you're eating a large portion of them with every meal. Vegetables are loaded with goodness. Eat them as much as possible for their cancer-fighting potential and pure wellness. This is where juicing is a plus. Where are the carbs? Now carbs can be a little tricky depending on the body type. Carbs give us energy and are very useful in putting a, a muscle mass and weight. But if you have fat to lose, stay away from pasta, bread, rice, and other starchy carbs. Go for a double serving of veggies, brown rice, or quinoa instead. However, if you have just worked out, your body needs the carbs, so go ahead and eat good healthy carbs in order to replenish your body. It's important to be carb conscious, but not overly obsessed. Where are the fats coming from? Our bodies need some fat from various foods. Make sure you're getting them from whole foods like eggs, fish, nuts, seeds, meats, and cooking with coconut oil or olive oil. Spread these out throughout the day. These are the five questions you should keep in mind with every meal and, serve as a ba and these should serve as a basic guideline. All body types are different and these demands can be much more focused per individual. But if you ask yourself these questions, you'll be putting yourself on the right track. Thanks for watching this video, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, please comment below, and remember, juice strong to live long.